So remember that as, as a community, part of our deen is that we enjoy the good and that we forbid evil. The goodest of goods, the best of goods are shared goods. No good is good if it's only good for us. The best of goods are absolutely shared goods. And the best good that we can share with people, in addition to our deen, is our understanding of the sense of justice, that this is a right that belongs to every single human being out there. And we don't want to be involved when only it concerns our community. That just makes us a selfish community if we only care about our um, if we only care about our rights. Remember, the more we protect the right of others, we are also protecting our own rights. In the Islam, we are taught that the main reason why Allah sent messengers, Allah tells us, لِيَقُومَ النَّاسُ بِالْقِسْطِ To establish to people, you know, the idea of, um, to teach people how to establish justice. It is the, the, the most important element in keeping any healthy, good society. And we need to fight for this. Number two, please keep hope alive. It's very easy to lose hope and go into despair in this current situation. We know that in the hadith, the Prophet, peace be upon him, said, Al-fa'lu husn al He said that to be an optimist is the best of, you know, that's like the best character to have. And like we said, it's very easy to be a pessimist at this point, given what is uh, what is going on. And and also remember, just keep keep fighting because the point is not to win. The point is that you remain on this journey that you are attempting to do something that is that is good. You mentioned that, you know, the case has my my name. It was nice initially, but then when it went to the Supreme Court, it was no longer Fazaga versus FBI, it was the FBI versus Fazaga. And then I said, uh oh, something is going on. Um, something is going on here. But uh, but like I said, this is this is not the worst story in the Muslim community. But we're hoping that we use this story to be a catalyst to give people the opportunity to tell their story. Please tell your story with us, Jazakumullah.